Hello everyone, today I'm gonna show you how to do a geo-referencing in AutoCAD. So you need to open your topo image in AutoCAD. Uh, insert button, there you can see attach, click on attach. Open your image file, topo image file. Click OK. Just give a left click. Move on a little bit and give a left click so here is my image in AutoCAD so before moving on that you need to draw a horizontal line give a vector command make sure your earth mode is on click a horizontal line make a horizontal line there now we need to align this image we need to align this image with this horizontal line so we can see this is the horizontal line this 67 line is the horizontal line in topo map and this black line is the horizontal line we draw in autocad now we make a reference with this horizontal line we make we make reference of this 67 line and align with this horizontal line so give a line command A-L-I-G-N select objects select the image except that line press enter specify first source point so in the leftmost corner uh, take this intersecting point as your first source point zoom in as much as you can to minimize the error give a left click now make a line perpendicular with the line that we drawn in CAD specify second source point now our second source point would be at the right side intersecting point so we take this intersecting point is a second source point so make a perpendicular with the horizontal line that we redrawn so now specify third source point uh, these two source points are enough so no need to specify third source point press enter it has said scale objects based on aligned points so we do not scale now so no enter. now our image is aligned with this horizontal line so now we can remove this line now we need to scale this topo image so before scaling let me show you that these are the string coordinates given here this 28 means it has given in this standard format 630000 therefore this 28 means 628000 and this 29 means 629000 therefore the distance between this line and this line is 1000 the distance between this line and this line is 1000 in topo map but in autocad it it doesn't match so we need to scale so we assume we make a line and assume that the distance between this line and this line is 1000 so now we make uh, 5000 line here you can give any dimensional line assuming as a 1000 as the gap between two intersecting point so it's a 1000 line 2000 line 3000 and 4000 in this intersecting point so give a left click is our reference line here now type a scale press enter select object select the image except that line press enter specify base point specify the standing st uh, starting point of the line is a base point here uh, as you can see in command line specify scale factor or copy reference so 
So we specify the reference here. So type and then press enter. So it says specify reference length. So this is our reference length. So click on starting point of the line. And second reference point is the ending point of the line. So left click on the end point of the line. Now it says specify new length or points. So we have assumed that the line is, uh, let me see, 1000, 2000, 3000, 4000. So our line we have considered is a 4000. So we give 4000. Now we can see the image is reduced. I'm sorry, the image is enlarged. We can see the line here is a very small, but the line is, 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 it was, but the image has been enlarged here. Now, let us check whether the point, whether the gap between these two points is 1000 or not. Dimension. So if, we, if it is not in the range between 999 to 1001, then we need to repeat the same process. with the topo map and not so it is 1001 if here it appears a 1004 then again you need to repeat the same process draw a line and scale and repeat the same process uh, specify, uh, specify reference length specify new length and again measure the gap between these two intersecting point so in this way you can minimize the error so now it's okay for in this case so our horizontal portion has been uh, scaled up now we need to scale a vertical portion as well uh, we measure the gap between this horizontal line here This is the intersecting point and we take a horizontal measure sorry we take a vertical measurement so we can see 1016.428 so we need to correct this vertical portion as well so note Note this value 16.4288. So here, so we need uh, to reduce this value. We need to reduce this 1016.4288 to 1000 because 1000 is the actual gap between those uh, uh, those intersecting point. because as we can see here it is 69 and 68 which is 30 it is a 30690 and this is 306800 therefore the gap between this line uh, is 1000 but here when we give a measurement it appears 1016 1016.428 so we reduce it to 1000 now that is our scale factor here.
So now we make now we can just move this so now the part is block now we make a block of this image so before making a block we need the coordinate of any intersecting point in this type of map and we mark the center line on the intersecting point so let's take this intersecting point and we mark here so the coordinate of this intersecting point is we can see 2 5 here which means is we can see the starting point of here 6 4 0 triple 0 therefore this 2 5 means 6 2 5 triple 0 so we note it down here 6 2 5 triple 0 that is our steam so likewise we note the y coordinate as well that is our northing so northing of this intersecting point is 3.6 point so our 6.6 point is the point where we, where we have marked this center line this is our 6 point we just need to right click select okay select pencil select the image select the image press enter press okay so now we have done with the block uh, now now we give an insert command here type I am just see our T insert so in insertion point we need to give an X and Y coordinate so X is six two five triple zero copy and So in X we no need to change uh, because we have already scaled uh, our horizontal portion so in Y we need to input the value that we have obtained from uh, doing the, this mathematical calculation so 0 0.983 is our value that we need to input in Y 0 0.9 Enter a now we can see our geofence image here. So, just to check whether the coordinate of this topo map match with the coordinate of AutoCAD or not, give a id command enter. X is a six two three nine nine eight six two four triple zero is the actual coordinate, so which is similarly uh, more or less same. Uh, and Y is three zero seven zero triple zero. you can geo reference your topo image in autocad so there are four command we need to remember uh, we need to assign align command and then scale command block command and insert command so using these four command you can geo reference your any topo map in autocad